Hello, YouTube. I know it's been a while since I've made my, um, crap. Since I made my last videos, and, um, I apologize for that. Um, so, yeah. I mean, a lot of, there's, there's quite a bit of things that are in there. Like, I mean, I got, like, I got a ripstick. Um, just so you know, it's a ripstick G, you know, the grind kind. Um, um, not too much, not a Transformers game. And, yeah. And, as you can see, this is another review, actual review, of ice cream truck combos, combiners, skids, and mud flap. I think we're going to start with skids first. Okay, so, first things first, um, I don't know if you can see that that well, but, um, he, he's got, he's got pretty good face design, except for the fact that his thing's kind of in the way, so, Benetta. Um, there are a couple things that are a bit different, um, for instance, if you'll notice on the deluxe version, which I have, but I don't really want to go and get it. Um, wait a second, he might, well, I don't really, I'm not wearing my glasses, so I can't exactly see, but, neither can you guys, but, you know, um, in the deluxe version, he has a golden tooth, and for me, it sort of looks like he does, but I don't think he does, so there's one difference. Also, um, well, he's got his funky face, pretty much the same, um, he's got his little monocle on this eye, except I think maybe on the deluxe version it was on the other eye, I don't know, um, not very tall, I'm actually 13 years old, my name is Ray, um, kind of small for my age, I guess, not exactly a midget, but, um, I don't know, um, anyways, um, he's, not too tall. I mean, if you know the size of Funkies, um, he's a bit bigger than Lotus. And, you know, all the Funkies are the same, so. He's not too big. I'd have to say, like, a couple three inches, maybe. Um, as for articulation, his arms can go up and down. They're a bit limited because of this little plastic thing right here, but, um, they can, they bend at two points in the elbow, cause it's on a ball joint, actually. Um, he has two translucent headlights, which is kind of nice. Um, his grill really good, and his big old hand, little big old masturbating hand. It's not that big compared to his little plastic hand um it's not it's not exactly it do, this one this hand does have a bit of articulation I mean it goes um forward and back I guess um his head can go up and down that's kind of because of the transformation um I think it does um, yeah, it does. It rotates 360 degrees. Um, now for his, um, legs. His waist articulation does go a bit, but it's kind of hindered by the back here, which kind of, not again, part of the transformation. But, um, anyways. His legs can go in and out. Um, they bend at the knee, rotate at the knee. Oh, and they rotate at the elbow here. I forgot that. Um, and goes up and down, and his legs can go up and down a bit, um, forward and back, sideways. So uh, quite a bit of um, articulation for such a small figure. I would get a better lighting. In fact, I'm, I'm going to try right now. So just bear with me, guys. There we go. Because, you know, if I've, actually my, my Logitech sucks because if I get a bigger one, it doesn't record, it do, um, uh, doesn't matter, who cares. Um, 
It's probably a bit more than ten minutes. Um. Anyways, I'm gonna do this in probably two parts. This is part one. Anyways. Yeah, that's skids. Made fresh for you. Yeah. All right. Our first transformation. Okay. First of all, you want to take this back part here and fold it down, and then you're gonna want to rotate that. 180 degree. What? Okay, um, anyways, sorry. Mama! It's not my phone. No! Sorry, someone called my name. Ray. Oops. Anyways, um, yeah. Okay, so you want to rotate at 180 degrees. Um, this little thing right here, you actually pull up. I already did that. Um, then you're going to want to go back around to the back. You're going to want to lift this up, rotate this 180 degrees too, and then you're going to want to basically push his arms down a bit, okay, so, there we go, then you're going to want to, um, basically line up his arms like that, okay, and do the same with the other, like that, don't fold him up yet, though, okay, next, um, fold, oh, well, first, also, you want to unhook that, Okay. Alright. Yeah, you have him like this. Okay. Now you want to push down his head a bit and push this down. Now, I don't know about yours, but mine has like a little error. Or if you push this thing down, it won't exactly stay down. Right now it's doing it a lot better than it normally does. Next. It was, yeah, push that down, okay? Um, it'll take this part and bring it up. Fold these things out. It's a lot of folding here. Same with the other. Okay, next, his arms, like the other, like his, I mean his feet, like the others, you want to fold them halfway. Push down, halfway. Push down. And just bring it up. They actually fold pretty good normally, but I just kind of like to do that. Anyways, um, once you've done that, then basically you just kind of bring these things up. Kind of a bit tricky. Maybe not for you guys, but for me it's a bit. Oops. And it's okay if it comes off because, you know, they're on ball joints. So doesn't really matter too much. Um, then you fold all these things up. Do the same with this one and bring it in. Oh yeah. It's a big old hand. You kind of want to fold down a bit. Really sorry about wasting you guys' this time. Like so. They have the front half of the ice cream truck. Alright. Bye.